Hello friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial series I'll be showing you how you can design a walking crutches in Kitchevi 5. What you're seeing over here is a completed design with textures and uh, let me zoom it inside for you. Here is the handle and uh, here you have uh, adjustable Here you have the adjustable rails with uh, it's being tightened with uh, screws and uh, bolts over here. And you have another nut and bolt right here. And uh, let's see how we can start up with the design. Firstly, as I've uh, as I always uh, show you, firstly go to new and go for a product, a new product. Once you click on the new product, uh, a new product opens up and uh, you need to name the product. As I do, that's uh, the walking crutches study. And let's come back to the design. So let me tell you, the dimensions which we use in this throughout the series is all assumed dimensions and I'm just uh, having a crutches in front of me and that's how I design it. I just see that in a design so I just assume every dimensions in it. So it's just, uh, just for the sake of uh, explanation of designing part. Firstly, I'll be designing the, uh, I call it the side rails. So for doing that, firstly, Go for insert and go for new part and click on the walking crutches and a new part opens up and then you could name that new part as a side rails and then you can double click on the part body so that the uh, tools gets changed to the part modeling and the next thing what you could do is just click on the sketch and uh, invoke the YZ plane and then as you can see here let me show you the crutches this is what we're going to design so we could design that by just uh, drawing a sketch and then um, running it through a circle or uh, you know to concentric circle so let's see that this is how it is so let's just come back over here and start the sketch a little above the X line and uh, before doing that let's just delete everything and just put a horizontal line and make that horizontal line at a distance of uh, 125 and zoom out so firstly before starting you could measure the complete length and that's what I did here and then you could come to this particular sketch so let's uh, close the unused toolbars so that's a good practice these are unused toolbars as of now just drag and drop it here close this and firstly one two three and just don't make it vertical just make it a little slanted so we got this basic sketch here and then you could uh, start dimensioning it so this particular height could be 5 centimeters just make sure that your units is in centimeters and you could make this height is 25 and this thickness as 3.75 
and then horizontal measurement here could be 1.25 that's a small slant there and then what you could do is just select this and go for a chamfer of radius 4 do the same thing over here radius 4 and finally select these two small points and just give a 4.4 centimeter there and that completes our first dimensioning, the basic dimensioning and if you have any doubts on this particular part of the tutorial please write to me below the video and I'll be getting in touch with you I hope this tutorial series is uh, going to be very helpful in your designing and uh, thank you so much for watching and stay tuned